guys, and Dre here with the Bucket Plugin Spotlight. Today we are going over the Loot Plugin. So basically the Loot Plugin turns all your chests into survival games chests, which is really, really cool. So basically I've reloaded the mod and basically what I do is that if I place this chest down and open it up, normal chest. Now you may see this and I'll teach you what that means right now. So basically if I type in the loot, which is really necessary, not sure why that's in capitals. Loot, it's meant to be not in capitals. And uncommon and common are pre two pre-made ones. You can make other ones in the config file. It's super easy. Um, minutes between refill, I'll say one. Player distance, only refill if the player is in a distance of 200 blocks. And min max. Uh, blocks inside of it, let's say 30 to 50. No, that'll be too much. 20, no, 4 to 7, 4 to 8. That works too. And then the blocks, um, that this sign is away from chest, we don't really need to put that because we're making it less than three blocks away. If it's more than three blocks away from the chest, then you need that. Okay, so now we've done that, and in one minute it'll refill. So I'm basically gonna wait a minute and be back. Okay, guys, so moving on to the second part of this tutorial. Um, after you're installing your loot jar and restart your server, you will find a config.yml file here. Open that up with text edit, and you'll get this weird junk. Sorry, my finder has just crashed. And. It's basically telling me uh, the pre-made list, and you can make more, and you can set up your world. I, I had set up before. Now, basically what this means is that it'll um, set up, it'll automatically make every chest in that world do that. So, let me just save this document, and now if I come here and reload my server, and it says reload complete. Now any chest that I put down every um, one minute is going to have items inside of it. So I'm going to put tons of chests down. And we are going to come back in a minute. Uh, that first chest, uh, that sometimes happens that the, um, the first time it's meant to always do that but it doesn't always do that unfortunately. So it should uh, fill up these chests. And as you can see, that chest is now full. Uh, this chest is now full. This chest is now full. And as you can see, it does do that. It just has some delay sometimes. And uh, yeah. So it'll randomly place it and it'll put, fr uh, it'll put potions, it'll put swords. Um, and these are diamond, iron swords, sorry. Potion of speed, potion of swiftness, um, and it's just really useful. Now I could see, well, okay, I could see tons of uses for this. For example, if you have um, a multiplayer survival games and you're just doing a one-time thing and you don't want to go through all the trouble of setting up a um, automated thing which requires a private port for itself and all that junk you just want a one-time thing which will work well this is it um, it always works well and um, yeah it's a tiny plugin uh, one megabyte so yeah download it link for the forum post will be in the description and as always good night